The incident happened here on Bradbury Road, several miles west of Turlock Glen. Witnesses began calling 911 to report a man beating a small child. The Sheriff's Department helicopter was in the area and responded within minutes. As the helicopter landed, the, uh, the flight officer, who was a Modesto Police Department police officer, um, got out of the helicopter, ran up to a fence, um, but the fence was an electric fence, so he wasn't able to make it over. He could still see the suspect was beating the child, the infant. Um, the officer pulled out his, his handgun, fired a shot, um, and killing the suspect on, on scene. The child was transported to a local hospital where he was pronounced dead. Officials continue to investigate. We don't know uh, why he was why he was beating the child. Um, the witnesses tried to intervene, uh, but they said the witnesses were saying that the suspect was appearing to be very violent, so they were kind of afraid for their own safety as well as the infants. Modesto police officers routinely ride in the sheriff's department helicopter. The Modesto police department. Uh, assign several officers to the tactical flight unit. Uh, these officers, they ride in the helicopter, they act as observers, um, they give, uh, they, they help locate scenes of crimes and suspects and operate some of the equipment inside the helicopter and that's what was happening today. Although the landing was risky, officials say it was warranted. The pilot made a very uh, uh, tough decision to land this helicopter, uh, a risky landing here in the middle of a cow pasture, and uh, and the and the flight off the tactical flight officer um, exiting the helicopter, barricaded by a barbed wire fence that uh, is electrified, and uh, it, everything was very risky about this. But obviously there was a life in jeopardy here, and uh, the officers made a tough decision. But that's uh, that's what they're trained to do. The boy was reportedly the man's son. Positive identification is pending notification of next of kin.